Noguera, Velasquez, UFC 110. Check your local listings. This is not an opponent you would take lightly. It'd definitely be your mistake to do so. People on the outside can say what they want about him, but if they got in the ring with him, you know, I think they'd be pretty funny because, uh, you know, it's easy to talk on the outside. And DeSanto said it best. He said, guy still has a lot of fight left in him. And that's it, man. I, I don't think training. that anyone should underestimate me, you know. Uh, when, uh, when you have a self-made fighter like I am and uh, with the uh, pride belt, I won. I earned, uh, you know, it's not good to underestimate me. And especially right now, I'm, I'm in really good shape and uh, I'm looking forward for that fight. He's going to always bear down and stick to what he what he likes to do. You know, that's his left side. Um, he's a southpaw stand-up fighter. But then you see him against the Santos, he tried to go for a takedown. So little things like that make you know that, you know, anything's possible and he could try anything. And, you know, he's brought in a huge monster of guys, so he's obviously very worried about my weight and things of that nature. So, uh, you know, I, I'm just going to go and do my thing. My thing is, you know, whatever happens. And uh, I'm, I'm going to more or less... Uh, do what I have to, to dictate the, the way this fight goes. He's very good uh, with ground and pound, as we could see with uh, his fight against uh, Andrei Alovsky, but uh, I'm, not, I'm not afraid. That even if he go on the ground, I will manage, but I don't think he will go on the ground. Noguera, Velasquez, UFC 110. Check your local listings.